Welcome to the fourth tutorial about the AG Granular Suite. In this tutorial, you will learn how to use the preset mixpad to interpolate presets programmed with the control module. The preset mixpad is a graphical widget which can be used to control interpolation of a collection of presets using a single XY pad. On the front panel of the preset mixpad module, we can set all the properties of the pad. But before we start talking about them, let's open the control surface itself. As you can see, it is an XY pad divided into multiple smaller pads. Each corner of each of the small sub pads can be assigned a preset number. When we click and drag on the pad, a message is generated containing the numbers of four presets assigned to the corners of the current sub pad. Each preset has also assigned a weight to it, which depends on the position of the pointer within the sub pad. You can watch how weights of each of the currently interpolated presets change on the front panel of the mix pad. The mix message generated by the mix pad can be then forwarded to any of the Jamoma modules in order to trigger interpolation of its presets. We can customize the control surface by changing its size in pixels and the number of rows and columns. Let's set the pad to float on top of other windows so it doesn't disappear when we are tweaking its settings. Note that as I change the number of rows and columns of the pad, the list of values in the long text box on the bottom of the module changes. This is a list of preset numbers currently assigned to the corners of the small sub pads. We can modify the preset numbers here, or we can do it in the matrix view which visually corresponds to the placement of the presets on the pad. Please note that if you decrease the number of columns or rows of the pad, you will lose the preset mappings in the removed cells. Now if you add a new row or column, the new cells will be filled with ones. You can reset the whole matrix by clicking this button here, which fills it with consecutive preset numbers row by row. Now since you know everything about how to set up the mixpad, Let's listen to how preset mixing sounds in action. This concludes the fourth tutorial about the AG Granular Suite. Stay tuned for the future tutorials which will cover more creative aspects of using the suite in composition and live performance.